Good morning. I am still half asleep, but welcome back to my channel. I am going to do a quick 30 minute walk on the treadmill just so I can get my steps in before I start the day. I mean, if it wasn't negative degrees outside, I would love to walk outside, but I'm just gonna use the treadmill. Oh my god, like I just look so tired. I went to sleep at 2 30. I shouldn't have done that. And now I woke up at like 9 40, and my eyes for some reason are kind of burning. So I'm just gonna do this quick 30 minute walk and then to go look at countertops with my mom after for our kitchen. Yeah, it's still not done. It's been so that's why you guys are not seeing any of my meals. And I'm going to actually get Starbucks today. I really want it. I haven't gotten Starbucks in so long. I'm gonna get ready really quickly because the countertop place is closed pretty early on a Saturday. And I know my mom's gonna start yelling at me if I don't go downstairs really quickly. But I just want to show you guys what I'm wearing today. Okay, so I'm wearing this sleeveless turtleneck. Um, my cousin actually gave me this idea because I like how that um, how it looks underneath like crew necks and stuff. But then without the arms, you don't get too warm. So I didn't think about that. Um, so I'm gonna wear that. That's from Zara. I got a size medium. And then I got this crew neck is so cute it says colorado it is from pretty little thing and i got a u.s large and then i am wearing my zara um mom jeans or boy i think they're mom jeans or boyfriend jeans i'll link them down below but they are true to size okay guys so i just did my hair like super quickly it probably looks like shit from the back but okay, so I just did that and I'm gonna put on some jewelry really quickly. But I'm wearing these necklaces that are from, um, Cal what's it, Ty Cali Tiger? I forgot what it's called, but Kylie, not Kylie, <laughs> Cali Tiger. I kind of signed up for their subscription thing, so I got this, but I don't want to have a subscription and pay every month. Um, so I canceled it after I got this one. Yeah, this is how this one looks super cute yeah i also got these rings from cali tiger if i'm saying the name wrong i'm so sorry i completely forgot what, what it was called but i'll link these down below okay guys so we just finished looking at countertops and me and my mom are like super picky she's with me right now so i feel a little bit awkward this is the first time that i'm filming in front of her um but yeah we went to go look at countertops and for the first time like we found one like right away otherwise it takes us so long to choose things like we took forever to choose the tiles but luckily we found something that we liked and the service there was so nice and now we're at starbucks my mom's trying starbucks for the first time okay she's never had starbucks um so she's looking for something to get and i don't know what i want to get but i want to get one of their uh, sandwiches um it's like mozzarella and i think pesto and marinara in that sandwich i forgot what the sandwich is called i think it's called caprizi i always say it wrong i don't know if i say it right um so i'm gonna get that sandwich and then i don't know what kind of drink i want i know i want something cold i always get something cold um and then i'm gonna get a chai tea latte for my brother i thought i was gonna annoy them so much because i had no idea what i was gonna get but the girl is so nice she's gonna give something very similar to french vanilla so it's gonna have the flavor and everything but she's not gonna put espresso because my mom doesn't really drink strong coffee she just drinks like one of those like indian style <laughs> coffees that they drink in india i don't know what the difference is but they're like not strong it's just more for the flavor <laughs> my mom's so funny <laughs> she's like staying quiet <laughs> and she's like laughing <laughs> she's laughing so much it's hilarious <laughs> oh my gosh she's laughing so much it's so funny i wish i could show you guys but she doesn't want to be on the camera um but like all day today in the morning she was like boosting me saying i'm so pretty but then there's other times where she's like saying I'm fat. <laughs> okay guys, this sun is so blinding. That's why I have this down. So I dropped my mom off at home because she had a bunch of things to do. So I'm just gonna put some gas and by the way, this is really good. I think it's called the ice green tea, peach green tea. I'm not too sure. But it's actually really good it's very refreshing so yeah i'm just gonna meet up with one of my friends because 
I don't want this outfit to go to waste and I want to get cute pictures and my friends down to take some pictures of me um, my friends are so nice I don't have to say it to them they're kind of just like okay I'll take a picture of you and then I'm gonna come home and start getting ready for dinner holy shit I am going out after months like months I'm sure everyone else is on the same boat but I'm going out after so long so I want to look at least somewhat cute but I'm kind of lazy at the same time I don't know I don't even know what to wear we're just going to this Italian restaurant I feel like I've been to it for like a work lunch before but I always forget where I go so maybe when I get there I'll realize <laughs> All the clips that you saw just now were from my last weekend and I didn't end up filming the rest of that day when I went out and got ready so I didn't end up filming my night that day because I just came home after I took those pictures and I sat in bed for like a couple of hours and didn't do anything and when it was time for me to leave the house that's when i started getting ready so i was like rushing to get ready um i can't believe i actually put lashes on even though i was running late like i actually got ready like decently but i don't know why i do this like it doesn't take me that long to get ready i just slack until i have to actually get ready like i just sit there on my phone so I, that's why I did, like i wanted to film my look but i didn't get to do that and then i went out for dinner and I put a clip of the food but like I didn't vlog at all so now I'm like you know what that wasn't really a long vlog it wasn't a full day there was really nothing that I showed so I mean I don't know how much I'm gonna show today it's the next weekend now okay so this morning I woke up and worked out and I ate my breakfast like wow I'm getting my life together guys like I worked out consistently this week so i'm really proud of myself but i really wanted to try that tiktok hack that people have been doing where you mix your eye cream with your concealer so i'm using my ole henriksen banana bright eye cream i love this eye cream it gives me a natural glow as well and i'm using this tarte creaseless concealer so it does say creaseless but honestly it does crease a little bit so let's see if it helps with the eye cream so i'm just gonna put some on my hand and mix it in Okay, wow that looks so natural it literally looks like i just put an eye cream on that has a bit of a tint i guess but wow that blends into my skin as you can see it looks very hydrated okay wow i really really like this i haven't been to the mall in so long and i know like i don't need to go to the mall but i'm gonna go to the mall i have to uh, first of all i have to return my curtains um I didn't like them and so that place they didn't have a returns because of the lockdown and they only had curbside pickup so I couldn't return those so I need to return those now um, and then I want to return some stuff at Sephora and get a few things as well and so I got some stuff for my bedding but I didn't get like a flat sheet I got those fitted sheets and I really think I should go get a flat sheet because, I mean, that's the ideal way of doing your bedding. Um, I don't know how many other layers people put, but I only do two layers. I do the fitted sheets and the flat sheets. And I was being very cheap because my duvet set that I got from Simon's, which I'll show you guys later when I come back from the mall, that one was 200 something dollars. So then when it came to actually buying the white sheets that I wanted, I kind of cheaped out and just got the fitted sheet. But now I'm like, no, you know what? I need... I really need my flat sheets. My hair is so oily. I haven't washed it for a whole week now. I want to wash it tomorrow. I wanted to wash it today, but then I also didn't want to deal with drying it. I don't like to dry it. I like to air dry it. And I also didn't want to go outside with wet hair because I'm going to the mall. I don't want to get cold. It's like getting warmer, but it's still cold here. So I'm just going to do like a sleek 
braid okay guys i am not going to the mall ever again i'm never shopping in person again oh my god i'm so tired and like i only went to like two stores that i needed to go to and i should have just done everything online because i could easily do everything online but like every single store has a huge line and it just gets so tiring like i'm so over it i'd rather buy everything online it's so much easier and they're like i only got two things okay like literally just two things one second so i got this milk primer okay i heard this is really good and I could have just got it online. I wanted two other things, but they didn't even have it in store. So first I returned my Pat McGrath um, foundation. It was like too orange for me. And honestly, when I put it on, it did not look like it's worth $90. So then I wanted to try the Estee Lauder foundation because I've heard it's so good. But the shade that the girl kind of matched for me, like she put it on a, a tray, not like on my skin because that's not allowed anymore. But like the shade that she matched they didn't have it in store so i have to order that online anyways and i got my flat sheet so this is the distinctly home company it's 400 thread count like my fitted sheet that i'm gonna show you guys later it's all white so i mean i'm gonna have to wash my face every single time i lay on this i cannot wear makeup on this or i might just put an extra sheet over every time i go to sleep but anyways this is supposed to be a really good brand and really good quality so i mean i'm doing adult things because this was alone like 70 something dollars for a fitted sheet and then the sorry for the flat sheet and then the fitted sheet was the same amount so it's not cheap it's not cheap being an adult okay <laughs> so i'm gonna go home i'm gonna eat and then we are going to do my bedding and then after i want to do my nails they're so nasty i'm sure you've seen in the video so far they're like disgusting so i'm going to do my nails using my machines that i ordered like the beginning of quarantine back in march 2020 so i'm going to use that because i did want to go to get my nails done but then i'm like i can do shellac at home so like it's not really worth it unless i was gonna get fake nails I can even do fake nails at home, but I'm too lazy for that. That's too much effort. Guys, time to make my bed look prettier. Um, so this is a duvet set that I got from Simon's. It's pretty expensive, but it looks so comfy. Okay, but first I am going to put this fitted sheet on from Distinctly Home that I showed you guys earlier. It's the same company. And then this is the flat sheet that I showed you guys before as well. It is 100% Egyptian cotton, which is supposed to be really good. Okay, so this bed that I have here is from Structube. I'm not sure if it's just a Canadian company. It might just be Canadian. I think they're based out of Montreal. Um, but I love this bed. It's so comfy. And it's really easy to clean. So I've already vacuumed it. I usually just have my small vacuum and just clean the top and the sides of the bed okay guys so i didn't think about this before it is really wrinkly and i don't have a steamer so i'm gonna put both the sheets in the dryer for a few minutes maybe like five minutes so i thought it would be smart and put it in the dryer but i've never done that before and i just thought like okay if i put it in the dryer i'll get rid of the wrinkles but there's even more wrinkles like there's so many wrinkles but whatever i am just gonna put it on and then when I lay on it, it'll get better. Hey guys, so I couldn't find that TikTok that showed how to actually properly fold a flat sheet. So I found a YouTube video and I'm gonna attempt it on my bed. Okay, so it's definitely not perfect okay but it looks clean and i kind of just stuffed it at the back over there i don't know what the correct way was for that at least i got the bottom corners right i think so anyways i'm not doing that ever again i really don't care anymore okay so the duvet obviously comes with pillows um this is more of a cream color compared to my white sheets. Pillows are from Ikea. I'm not sure what they're called, but this is the number. 
these are really comfortable pillows i tried looking for them again to get more from there but they didn't have them when i went last time okay so this is my duvet from ikea it's pretty thin but the reason why i like this one is that i can use it all year round i can use it in the summer i can use it in the winter and as you know i live in canada so the winters are really cold um and i don't feel so cold if i do feel extra cold i'll have an extra blanket okay i feel like my duvet is way too thin and that's why it doesn't look as comfy as it did in this picture like that's how it looks in the picture so it looks really comfy and like fluffy but mine doesn't look so fluffy it does not look fluffy at all i think i'm gonna keep it but later on i'm gonna get a fluffier duvet okay so i've had this fluffy soft little pillow from simon's for a little while now so i'm gonna put that in the middle i'll fix that later okay so i also got these two small pillows they're from h&m home and then i also got pillow covers from h&m home this is like a beige color and honestly they have really cute stuff i saw somebody's story of like i don't know where they were i think montreal has a h&m home and it looks so nice i just want to go to one um but here like they just have it online but this is how the pillow cover looks it's kind of like a sofa type material but i like this idea because then i can always change it up later if i want to do a different design too big <laughs> why oh my god i should have tried these on before because i've had this for too long i think i've probably passed the return policy time okay guys i just showered i washed my hair i like to comb it down with the bristle brush and then i put one of these spiral things on the top and i let it dry up just a little bit so it's just a little bit damp from the bottom and then i do a braid and then when I wake up my hair looks really cute and curly so I'm gonna use these gel polish that I got from Amazon okay so I just took off the nail polish but look how long my nails have gotten except for this one these ones always break somehow like I think it's because I use them the most hey guys so my battery's about to die but I'm almost done my nails this is how they look I just have to put the top coat on um they're a little bit messy but i mean it will last a long time because it's gel so yeah that's all for this vlog i hope you guys enjoyed it and if you did please give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and click on that notification bell and i will see you guys again soon bye now